Oh, good day. Good day. Oh, <laughs> we've had more than I think, you know. Right then guys, we're going to be doing a little bit of feeder fishing down here today. Scale the gate steps. We haven't been down here for about a year because they've been, uh, this whole thing's been closed. They've been doing a load of um, flood defence work, etc. But yeah, hopefully we can do a little bit of bagging out of here today. But before all that guys, my main man Dominic, he's managed to qualify for the £6,000 Northern River Masters final. That's going to be absolutely amazing guys. We're gonna, he's going to be coming down soon anyway. So yeah, let's get to it shall we? Let's go. Right then guys, here goes first cast. Swearing by these red deaders lately. Start with three red deaders. Got a load of them in the ground bait. Bag in. We've clipped up. Just over midway. Fish this peg in over a year. Cause see, hey, you couldn't fish it. Boom. Just gonna get a bit of bait going in. Got a big old feeder on just to start with. Fill a bit of bait in. It's only been open a couple of weeks. I've heard of a couple of fish coming out of here. Should be good get to it fish and your babby I think roach I'll take a roach for a first fish decent roach good few ounce fish Boats kicking about today. Bag in. Red deaders, that took about 10 minutes. I had a couple of bites before all that, but there's just bits messing about with it. Real savage bites, if I'm honest. Boom. Boats everywhere. Sunday, that's why. They don't bother me until you have to wait to cast for them. Because there's quite a lot of times where you'll have the actual feeder out. And it hadn't moved and a boat will go over and it'll waft that bait up off the bottom. And a nearby fish will just reaction strike straight on it. And it'll catch you a fish. So they're not all bad boats. It's the 6,000 pound final, man. Oh. <laughs> I'm getting regular bites, so I just said my first fish here. Eh? Only had a couple of casts. Round, I had it in there, but wind's a bit of a nightmare and I couldn't see. I had it on, like down yesterday. It's that thing with boats and all. Yeah. Uh, Flying goes right out, they're likely to catch it, aren't they? Look at that. Didn't even hit the bottom. Yeah, that's the, the bites I was getting. You have to land it on them. Skimmer or a big roach. <laughs> roach, skimmer. Big old roach. Ah, skimmer. <laughs> Fish. 
Right. That's what we want. And smaller ones turn up. Big ones aren't far away. It's a bit deeper down here as well. That's going to be a nightmare, that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Never. Couldn't write it, could you? How many times have we said though, it has to happen at some point? Do you know what I mean? It has to happen. Yeah. The boat goes over it, watch this. Look at that look. That was a good old bite, that. Yeah. Yeah, they're not all bad boats, we've seen that earlier on. That fully ripped round that. Start getting into those bigger ones. We'll turn up. Another fish. There's my main man in York Rescue Boat. I hate fishing in wind me, you know. It's a decent rut. Is it a rud? I thought it was a rud. Big roach. Good 10 ounce roach, that. Oh yeah, can you imagine them on float? Beautiful roach, 11 ounce. Big old roach. You just can't feel fish properly when it's windy. That's what annoys me. Can't play them right. Can't see bites and that. I can feel it darting about. Oh, roach, roach do that, don't they? Another decent roach. Skimmer. Roach, I don't know. <laughs> Hybrid, yeah. That's why we can't distinguish what she is. Yeah, an hybrid, that. Yeah. Well, uh, we're on track for a decent day here, you know. A couple of them bigger ones and I'd be happy. This wind dying down a bit I'd be happy with. But that's the reason I'm bagging like this. There's definitely some high, definitely some high pressure some coming over. Tell with changing weather. And there's that warm breeze as well, it's warm isn't it? Yeah. It's getting tattered on the way down, that's all bleak. Yeah. Skimmer. Better skimmer that. Has to be right here, it's coming right at me. Better skimmer, look at that. Straight away. Yeah. 
a skimmer, three um, three perch is had. Yeah. Burla. Oh. You can go in like that. Bag in. This will rip straight round. Can't, it's that windy, I can't tell what's happening. I've caught it, like. Be hard bringing a big one in. Perch, maybe. Swinger, it's too big to be a swinger that one. It's flipped out, isn't it? Holds a perch. Cast with three casters. Come on. Nah, maybe a. I don't know. Yeah, probably a skimmer. It's coming at me. a perch, decent perch. Uh, pink. <laughs> Skills. Sacking them. Put casters on to try and keep them away. Still having it. It's a perfect weight, that 28 grammar in this wind. I think the wind was just... But you couldn't tighten up to it every time wind blew, it pulled feeder towards me a bit. Slackened line off. Whereas that's just allowing me to nip up to it. Bang. Yeah, I do. Just gets it to where I want it to be. Probably another perch. Skimmer. 
Gemma. I must have had 10 pound already. Must have done. I've had 10 of them. Plus that decent one a minute ago. Yeah. That's a decent fish, that. Um, when you sat here, aim for that lowest, um, lowest leaf on that bush there. Can you see it? That's left at sign, yeah. Give him a go for two seconds, and he's sacked. Oh, that's best one yet. Look at that. Two and a half pound. Yeah, they were like my skimmers yesterday. Oh, <laughs> That's what I told them all. Maggots? No, caster. The darker caster. Yeah, I prefer to put the darker ones on. That's a decent skimmer, that. Yeah, you could put two dark ones on and then a lighter one. Earlier. Yeah, I might have been slightly skimmers, but I don't Oh <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I think if you have four of them, that's ten pound, isn't it? Oh, right. right in scissors, man. I grabbed it and spat it out and tried to. Yeah. They're here now. I told you, them casters, man. They're just. I knew they was going to produce those bigger fish. Keep all bits out at road. I think this is a better fish. Maybe. Yeah, it has to be a decent skimmer. It's taking line off me. It could be a big perch. Yeah. It's a sound bomb. I think it might have done. It has. Give of a what was that? It was doing whatever it wanted. Right then, guys, the weather's changing us quite a lot. We're gonna get these fish out of the water and see what we've caught, give them away, etc. Let's do it quick, man, because we're drenched. Oh, we've done all right after we're done. Come on. Nice to see a bit of rain, to be fair. Oh, good day. Good day. <laughs> We've had more than I think, you know. Maybe about 15 pound in there. Wow, what a day. What a day. Oh my lord. Good day, that you know. It's been non-stop since I sat down. Fifteen pounds. Fifteen, sixteen pound. Good day. Smashing bag of fish right there, if you can see them. Wow. Absolutely mental day there guys, there was bites from the start, it's been raining for about two hours now, bit of a nightmare, but yeah, beautiful stuff. Thanks for watching the video guys, if you enjoyed it, I'd really appreciate you going down below, smashing that like button, also, maybe consider subscribing.
and I'll see you in the next episode.